Hi, I'm Andrea. Welcome to my channel. Hi, again I'm at the uh, side of the River Yar uh, in uh, Norwich or Thorpe St Andrew uh, to be more precise and uh, it's a little bit slightly not warm but a little bit not so freezing today seven degrees uh, out there but uh, still wrapped up though and uh, sun's trying to come out uh, over there whether you can see the sun or not uh, but yeah so anyway I'm going for my hair removal appointment again um, so I've not sort of uh, had to uh, sort of shave as such uh, so I uh, look a little bit kind of uh, messy around here at the moment and then afterwards uh, I'll be okay and uh, so anyway so I've had quite a few sessions now and it's going really well I've had the top lip done um, and uh, it's getting less uh, prominent now uh, and looking a lot better and of course uh, I'm sort of a little bit um, kind of uh, you know uh, a bit early for my appointments today um, sort of got here about sort of an hour early so I just went for a hot chocolate uh, nice little cafe across roads called Harley's uh, which is uh, over that way somewhere <laughs> and uh, anyway and of course there's a nice art deco flats behind me as well which is a sort of landmark along the side of the river here and uh, but yeah so today I've got my um, sort of like a, so a shorter skirt on today and long boots um, of course you can see um, and so yeah it's a nice sort of pink skirt and uh, with a sort of little um, model sort of pattern to it and um, yeah so that's kind of really uh, it's kind of it's lined as well so it's not, not too cold a little bit you kind of that little bit of gap between your top of your skirt and your boots you kind of just feel that little bit of wind going through a little bit so, yeah should be really wearing jeans should I or something really or leggings something underneath but anyway um, next to uh, sort of busy barney boats here which uh, are not frozen today um, and uh, I don't know if my it's my um, uh, phone being kept level on this uh, selfie stick um, I think so uh, I'm not sure uh, maybe a little bit lopsided I'm not sure but anyway that's okay <laughs> and uh, so as long as you can see me and uh, you can see the uh, nice views here but it's lovely uh, scenery here and uh, so yeah so just um, probably I might have to do a little boat trip down the river uh, perhaps when it's a little bit warmer and uh, uh, maybe that's another little video and uh, maybe a boat trip along here and uh, also I'd like to do a little boat trip um, or maybe do some punting along uh, at Cambridge on the River Cam so that'd be uh, uh, and sort of make an interesting video as well and um, of course I've still got my um, uh, if those of you who've seen my short uh, which was on last night or the, uh, or the other day depending on when you're watching this video um, and wears a blue satin blouse and has some 80s uh, inspired music playing in the background uh, which was uh, given to um, yeah given to me by uh, a friend um, or made for me by a friend um, and um, for my uh, up and coming video uh, so sort of some background I may use it in other videos as well uh, so that's really great some friends is a musician um, and uh, and he's uh, offered to do more music for me so which is really great so it stops all this kind of um, wondering how to get royalty free music and things so you don't get copyright issues um, on uh, YouTube of course because if you play um, commercial music uh, you can get uh, sort of uh, flagged for copyright and things and uh, of course um, I'm trying to get monetization at the moment of course and um, so that's uh, I need to make sure my um, channel is okay um, for things like that and uh, and it's obviously not any inappropriate content of course as well <laughs> which uh, I know um, obviously uh, yes um, but I'm gonna maybe also do a video on uh, got some hosiery which uh, um, I want to do a video on as well so you can see my legs <laughs> and uh, uh, but yeah see all the nice hosiery and things that uh, I've got uh, one, two, uh, nice things to uh, try on and uh, so that'll be a sort of a glamorous video maybe um, complement my uh, 80s uh, fashion video as well uh, and that will be sort of like um, so I'll do a few more fashion videos and things like that, uh, do some more out and about videos, uh, going out and around and uh, so I've got, um, I'm also planning on doing 
maybe a video in a little town called March, uh, I think it's in Cambridgeshire, uh, and I think the um, uh, river goes through it, Brunin or Welland or something, it might be Welland I think goes through it, not sure, I'll have to check, uh, but, um, but yeah, a little town called March, uh, which I'm going to probably try and do in March sort of thing so video from March in March and uh, so that would be um, yeah kind of a novel thing okay I mean it's looks sort of on Google Earth it looks interesting so I've been there uh, before only at night time so with camera club uh, meetings there uh, we've had camera club competitions uh, with March Camera Club so yeah so that's uh, so a big shout out to March Camera Club uh, if you're anyone of you watching uh, sort of um, yeah we've kind of race been Hunt Stanton Camera Club um, and we had uh, well still have actually and uh, so um, yeah we have uh, battles sometimes from uh, with March um, and uh, Whiz Beach and uh, one two other Peterborough Peterborough a really great club as well so anyway lots of uh, great camera clubs about and uh, really into my photography as well so hopefully throughout the year you'll see some more of my pictures and things and maybe do some slideshows in some of the uh, pictures as well so uh, you know in some of the videos rather um, do some slideshows uh, like with St Ninian's Cave and uh, Brancaster and Thornham uh, the slideshows maybe um, one or two people said they enjoyed those so I'm going to do some of those so I've got lots of things planned it's just getting around to doing it of course and uh, also had uh, my first uh, Patreon uh, as well so a really big uh, thank you uh, to my first uh, Patreon there and uh, so I need to do content for Patreon as well um, and uh, so I've got to get something organised for that and it's just getting everything, getting myself into gear, getting things done um, and uh, so I really do appreciate all those who support me uh, and, uh, and of course again if you support my Patreon um, then uh, so again all goes towards uh, helping me because I can get out and you know pay for a bit of petrol and the fuel going out to places as well do more videos and uh, and uh, buy more equipment as well like this selfie stick I'm using uh, and other things of course um, but yes it's sort of um, because I mean I'm not uh, working fully at the moment because I've got sick, uh, on sort of sick benefit moment due to my illness uh, that I'm getting over uh, I'm getting a lot stronger and everything but it's some days I mean last few days I was not feeling so well um, and I uh, didn't feel like doing much at all really um, and today I'm feeling sort of better so it kind of I'm gradually getting better but some days I just don't feel great don't feel like doing anything I just want to lie there and just can't do things and the other days um, I sort of feel like almost on top of the world you know it's sort of strange really but I think it's a slow slow process getting there uh, getting back uh, into things and um, just getting back into the real world and also you kind of your confidence goes as well a lot especially after a long uh, serious illness uh, you, you kind of get um, you just feel you know it's just hot, really awful to describe those who've gone through it Will know but um, it's you know trying to bounce back it's not a necessarily uh, it's not a straightforward easy thing to do it's to you know trying to get back into the real world because sometimes you think oh you know am I going to be okay if I go somewhere am I going to feel okay and um, I'm going to feel if I get there and I want to get back and so on but yeah I mean last year I did make Scotland uh, which was a big big uh, thing for me I really had to push myself to go there um, and uh, that was, uh, you know, I kind of probably wasn't quite ready really, but I really did push myself to do that. But um, something I wanted to do and uh, wanted to go. And, uh, and of course, um, my um, friend from Scotland may well is planning a visit to see me as well. And uh, uh, and um, friend, uh, another friend I made in Scotland as well wants me to. Uh, visit sometime as well so um, so that's uh, so maybe I'll be going back up there sometime uh, and um, I also got a maybe I might possibly be if I get a passport and everything I might even be going to Portugal as well sometime that's going to want to drive down there so I'd love to drive down there take my kit car and uh, just drive down uh, all the way maybe whether drive through France uh, Spain and then Portugal or whether get a ferry from um, Plymouth or Portsmouth to Santander. Some people say it's a bit rough in the Bay of Biscay. So, um, although now I've not got the stomach, <laughs> can I sort of, yeah, I still feel squeezy and everything, but uh, yeah, do I kind of 
I don't know. I'll see. I, might, I like the idea of driving through France and Spain as well, anyway. And I'd love to take my car to Monaco um, as well, sort of there. That'd be fantastic. That would be you know, uh, parked uh, on the quayside in front of all the yachts, uh, luxury yachts, and sort of do a selfie there and look at my car. And well, it's sort of my yacht for five minutes. <laughs> and uh, it's kind of like, yeah, put a hundred euros or something on the roulette wheel uh, and win um, a million euros or something like that great you know that'd be uh you know <laughs> you could dream can't we you know and uh yeah that'd be great <laughs> but uh yeah that would be, i think from where friends live in portugal it's about a thousand miles or might be thousand kilometers uh to monaco so it's kind of like mm, would i want to do that sort of journey um i'll have to see we'll see how i feel but uh ah yeah i've got some well, so um, yeah, they're kind of like um, yeah. So we've got some activity on the river here. So yeah, this is really great. Anyway, so I'm going to go now and uh, do um, get to my appointment um, and uh, uh, maybe sort of see you probably around Norwich a little bit later. If not, uh, I'll see you all soon. Anyway, but uh, okay. So I'll probably um, yeah. I'll, see, I'll do a little video later, um, and uh, hopefully it might be a little bit darker then. So anyway, see you all soon. Yeah, it's a little bit windy now in Norwich and uh, I've uh, just uh, been to a shop behind me called Imelda's and I bought some really nice tights which may feature in one of my uh, future videos and uh, they do some really funky tights and there's well some kind of nice kind of 1960s inspired as well which uh, look really great so maybe they they might uh, feature get some like that uh, maybe come back next week and uh, get some more. Um, and uh, they look kind of really funky so there might be some funky fashion uh, 60s inspired videos as well uh, as well as my 80s uh, ones I'm going to do but uh, getting a little bit colder now anyway so I'm going to head off soon um, and uh, just near the uh, place in the town hall uh, just there this is famous town hall in Norwich um, and uh, so yeah I'm just had a nice tea and cake in Midi's tea room as well so yeah, I'm going to just head back and um, let's uh, have a sort of slow so walk back to the car and uh, I might just call in Gerald's on the way back as well. Uh, and uh, so yes, it's uh, um, but uh, yeah, I've had a good day around Norwich and uh, had uh, some hair removed around my top lip again and some dark hairs and some lighter hairs as well. Uh, so kind of looking, uh, or feeling a lot better it's sort of settled down a bit now it's not quite so um sore uh because when you first have it done for about an hour it's a little bit tender and uh but yes that's um but i've kind of got uh you know, it's quite a nice day really uh it's gone a little bit cloudy now the sun was out earlier but um yeah so i'll uh, hopefully uh we'll get um a few more items together for my 80s fashion video uh, I keep saying I'm going to be doing it and uh, when it comes up and uh, so my hair's all over the place at the moment as well I really do need to get my hair sorted out maybe I should get an 80s wig or something as well uh, for the video and uh, nice big hair and uh, something set up with it so make sure I don't bump into people as well and uh, so yeah a lot of uh, it's amazing isn't it walking around and He's kind of like, you're not really looking where you're going and other people aren't looking where they're going and then you end up kind of clashing and bumping in. So anyway, so I'll see you all um, in a future video and uh, look out for my shorts, uh, short videos. I might even do one wearing shorts as well for a short and uh, shorts for a short. And uh, so I've got some uh, kind of PVC shorts as well, which I might uh, wear in one of the short videos. And uh, so anyway, we'll see you all um, very soon. And thank you all for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe and uh, see you all very soon. Okay, thank you. Bye. Thank you all for watching today's video. I hope you've really enjoyed it. Please remember to like and subscribe and hit the bell icon if you want to get notifications for future videos. Future videos.